Hey there, welcome to Solve My Math Homework. We are the YouTube channel that solves only the math problems our subscribers send in. So today we're looking at a probability problem. And I don't love how it's worded, but I'm gonna read it exactly how it came in and then we'll talk about what it really means. It says, what is the probability of an earthquake at least once in 10 years if the probability of an earthquake in a single year is 2.49%? All right, so what they're really saying when they have this awkward wording here, the probability, when they say the probability of an earthquake at least once in 10 years, they're talking about the probability of at least one earthquake in 10 years, okay? And they've given us the probability of an earthquake happening for any given year. When they say in a single year, that's any given year. All right, good news is we know probabilities have to add up to one. All the probabilities of an event have to add up to one, right? And there are only two options when you have, when we're talking about an earthquake. Either you have an earthquake or you don't have an earthquake. Okay, so what I mean by that is if we're looking at the probability concerning having an earthquake, there either is an earthquake in a given year or there is not an earthquake in a given year. It is really that simple, okay? So since they gave us the probability that there is one in any given year of 2.49%, then the, the probability that there is not an earthquake has to be one minus the probability that there is one. So one minus 0 0.0249, okay? So the probability that there is no earthquake in any given year then is 0 0.9751. Okay, great, that's just one year. So let's talk about what's the probability that there's no earthquake in 10 years, okay? Let's get a clean sheet, I've written it out here, okay? So the probability of no earthquake is one minus the probability that there is one, but that's just one year. So the probability that there's none in 10 years is simply that probability, 0 0.9751 raised to the 10th power. Okay, I don't expect you to do that. Let's just put it into the calculator. And that is gonna be 0 0.7771, let's just call it 0 0.777. Okay, we've got a one, two, six, so one, three, okay? All right, so that's the probability that there's none in 10 years. Okay, so let's think about this. If there's none in 10 years, we have the probability. So the probability, probability sorry, that there's at least one in 10 years has to be one minus that, right? So the probability that there's at least one is one minus the probability that there's none, okay? So that means that it's one minus 0 0.77713, okay? And we get that number and it is 0 0.2228. So we can just say it's about 0 0.22, okay? So that's the probability that there is at least one earthquake in 10 years given that the probability of an earthquake in any given year is 2.49%. All right, I hope that helped. If you have questions, please pop them in the comments section. And remember, I only did this video because a subscriber sent it in. So if you're doing your homework and you don't understand something and you need to, send it to me and I'll get to it. Thanks, bye.